Hey yo what's up Marjorie here and welcome to another Wednesday Night Review and today we are back with Enmix because apparently uh, Sonya is just a pre-release MV so we are uh, now going to be checking out their actual comeback MV which is entitled Dash and yeah let's see what Enmix uh, has in store for us with this one so let's get right into it here we go. Dash, I wanna dash, I wanna run it. Dash, I wanna dash, I wanna run it. Dash, I wanna dash, I wanna run it, run it, dash. Okay. You can't feel that. Ooh. The pop's gone to roll out. Hey, one going all fierce like that right away. Ooh. Ooh. The vibe of this MV Is that dynamite? They really are going super fierce for this one. Mm. Of course, it would be a prison and then in the middle of the sea. Ooh. Liking the styling in this part. Everyone just looks so cool. Oh. Super speed. Well, it is the title dash. Hmm. Oh, Peacock! Oh, that's quite the mix of stuff. Oh! They suddenly got the tonal change. This actually reminds me of... Oh, oh. I just wanna continue my pace. <laughs> yeah, the, the change up reminds me of oh oh. That was strong. Oh, the, the credits are bunching up on the top. Nice. Wow. <laughs> Okay, so that was Dash by Enmix, and man, I, like, I was not expecting that. Like, Enmix tracks, uh, usually aren't afraid to hit hard, and we've ha we have had tracks from them that hit quite hard, but this one is, uh, like, on quite another level. It is a bit darker, it's a bit grittier. But uh yeah, it's also quite a bit fiercer as well. Oh man, I don't know quite 
what else to say about this. But th that change up though, the change up into the the stuff where they were suddenly like in the sky on those floating rock things that really does remind me a lot of OO because it's kind of the same thing that happened there and then uh, after a few bars of that it quickly switches back uh, to before and that also reminds me of OO <laughs> right, but yeah let's like we're no stranger to switch ups as well. Like, it's not just OO. They've had switch ups in a bunch of their other songs. But this particular set of switch ups uh, is very reminiscent of OO, particularly the way that they, they were on those. Uh, we had this like fantasy stuff and they were in the clouds and stuff like that. Oh. But yeah. The member that really, really caught my attention in this one. K1. Like she was able to pull off the uh, gritty, hard-worn look in the start. And then when you got to the, uh, the cityscape scenes, I, I really like her styling there. And she was just she just looked really really cool especially when we got that part with her about to dash off she had those like magenta purple eyes uh i i think that was the color uh or maybe i miss saw it but yeah like <sighs> this song from nmix just really really hits you i was about to say hits you differently but we got a lot of that i mean like each endmix song does hit you differently but this one really plain hits you <laughs> like a like a slap from out of nowhere Oh man. Yeah, this 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 is great. Like I'm glad that we have this kind of group in in the industry right now where you get just the the right mix of experimental. They're very experimental in their sound, but they manage to to hit it really well at least for me for my for my personal sensibilities they managed to hit that experimental sound quite well or that experimental structure quite well so yeah oh preference wise though i'm not sure if this will make it into my playlist it's not the typical song that i usually listen to but I do like it. It's it's a really epic song from Nmix. We'll see. We'll see if it does make it onto my playlist. Cause yeah, it's it's not my typical playlist, especially since my my daily playlist is what I listen to when biking. I really can't imagine myself listening to this while I'm biking. Uh there are parts where the beat just like takes its time and does some staccato rhythms and like <laughs> uh, how will that affect my biking? I don't know. Uh, but yeah, I will probably still be like listening to this over and over again, even outside of my regular playlist. So there's at least that. So yeah, I think that's it for my reaction to Anmix's Dash. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Also feel free to check out my Patreon, where I also post reactions to longer form content, more casual content, most of which is available for free. You can probably see the titles pop up here on the side. There's also some bonus stuff 
uh, set aside for those who are kind enough to subscribe, such as access to my K-drama and anime reactions, um, which incidentally you can also access for free for 7 days, as that is tier 1 on my Patreon, and it has a 7 day free trial. Uh, upper tiers of my Patreon also get early access to raw recordings of my reaction videos and priority when it comes to recommendations. But don't get too fussed about all that, like I said, most of the stuff on my Patreon is available for free, so don't be afraid to check it out. The link to my Patreon is in the description down below, as well as a link to a spreadsheet where you can more easily navigate and access the free content on my Patreon, so you might want to start with that, that's also in the description down below. Anyways, thank you so much for watching, thank you so much for joining me on this uh, very <laughs> epic and hard-hitting journey with Nmix. Until next time, have a great day everyone and hope to see you guys in the next video. Bye for now.